Hey everybody, it's Tom Abbott from MyMidtownMojo.com and MyAtlantaMojo.com. Apologize for a little bit of that echo behind me. I'm actually in a vacant condo here at Viewpoint Midtown, uh, one of my listings that we're just uh, making a change here on, and wanted to get a market report out to you for Midtown Atlanta. This market report will cover October. Uh, just a couple of disclaimers about a market report. It's really a snapshot. Remember, it was taken on a particular day. So literally by the end of the day or the next day, it could change. So always keep that in mind when we do a market report. Secondly, when I did this report, um, Midtown is covered in the MLS under an area called Area 23. That's how we list property. So I pulled numbers for all of Area 23, and as you'll hear when I go through the report, definitely some of these areas are not Midtown or what you might think of as Midtown, but still will give you an over idea of what's, overall idea of what's going on in the market. So let's touch base first on single family homes for October. There were 170 active listings. Uh, they ranged from 3.195 million in Ansley Park to a low price point of $275,000 in Reynolds Town. Uh, pending, under contract, contingent based on a kickout clause, due diligence, inspections, that type of thing. There were 75 homes under contract. They ranged in price from 1.249 million for a home on Charles Allen Avenue in historic Midtown to $315,000 again in Reynolds Town. For single family homes sold in the month of October, there were 29 sales that closed, uh, ranging from 1.74 million for a home in Morningside to $393,000 for, you guessed it, Reynolds Town. So at least from area 23, it sounds like Reynolds Town was pretty hot considering it had the lowest price uh, for a home that was available, under contract, and sold. So definitely some things happening in the Reynolds Town area uh, in the in-town Atlanta real estate market. <laughs> Uh, for condos and townhomes, we call those attached based on our listing service. Uh, there we had 232 active listings in the month of October. They ranged from a whopping $4.336 million for a condo at the new Opus Place, which is yet to break ground, um, to a low of $65,000 at Ansley North. Ansley North is actually a co-op type uh, community. We really don't have very many co-ops. Here in Atlanta, I won't go into explaining what that is. So to give you a little bit better idea of, of more realistic numbers for a low, low point, uh, we had $100,000 at City Heights and $101,000 at 1280 West for a low point in condos. Those under contract, we have 159 under contract for the month of October. The highest was I'm sorry, was $899,000 for a townhouse on 7th Street and the lowest priced home under contract was $105,000 also at 1280 West condominiums. Sold in the month of October, we have 102,000, 102,000, excuse me, 102 homes that sold. Uh, highest price was $746,000 for the square at Glen Iris, that would be a townhouse. And then the lowest price was $120,000 for a uh, condo at 12th Street Commons. I will admit to you that when I pulled these numbers and didn't have a chance to go back and do it again, I did not list the average days on market. So I will certainly make sure that we have that on the next report that we do. So I apologize for not having that information for you. But again, just a snapshot for the overall Midtown market. Keep in mind, real estate is so local, local, local. It's all about location, location, location. So you might live here in Viewpoint Midtown or Plaza Midtown, or you might live in Historic Midtown. Any one of those areas is going to be totally different. So if you really want a more microcosm idea of like what's going on in your specific building, just let me know. You can email me or my, I'll give you my email address. It's tom at mymidtownmojo.com or give me a call at 770-713-1505 and I'd be happy to discuss the market with you in your particular building or location here in Midtown. Again, Tom Abbott with MyMidtownMojo.com and MyAtlantaMojo.com at Palmer House Properties and my number is 770-713-1505. We'll see you again soon.